this lesson I'm going to do cathedral windows and I've got my fabric and we're going to start up on this corner squares. So I'm going to come down the first one on a semicircle across in a semicircle then down and each, to each point of these squares. I'm going to come across into the point down to the point up to the point, over to the point, down to the point, up to the point and across. I'm going to do that right across this little grid. Using the edge of your foot to come to the edge of the chalk mark. And it should give you quite a nice little sensor. And when we get say, to hit through the end, we come back down and we're going to come back like this. So we'll go across once more, up to the point, across to the point, down to the point, up to the point, across, down, up, across, down, and up. And you get a quite a good little rhythm going, and you will see that you are forming some flowers. Another element to it where you can make them stand out more if you chose. I'm going to come across once more, providing I haven't lost too much of my floor. have some flowers forming here but we also have circles forming so I'm going to do one more row and then we'll look at how we can make these a little bit more different from the norm you can get a nice rhythm going to embellish a few of these seeing as we've got a few done and I've just come into the corner here and I'm going to go one two and three and if you can a little stem at the end it looks okay one with a little round bit and back, two with a little round bit and back, and three. And travel on your lines.
can see it will make quite a nice design and a little bit different. We can also use the flowers and this is the centre of the flower and we can just, well I would do small figure eights. see we can have some flowers as well which makes a little bit of a change and a little bit of a different when you want it and we can also have some circles so we have a circle around here and I'm just going to down so we have little stalks and stems some flowers and some circles and we have just the cathedral so we can make quite a few designs just by using this simple or easy as I think maybe you don't think it's that easy we can also get into the mood or into the way of doing some functions been using for the cathedral windows so it's a good way to get used to doing them also have little stems in
coming straight up or you can make them come from the side. We're learning that it doesn't have to be just a plain clamshell. We can add something different into it to give it a little bit more oomph, if you like, for want of a better way of saying it. So we can come straight across, put a circle, straight across, put a circle. Nothing has to stay the same. And we can go back to our three stops. As you can see we don't have to stay with just the plain semicircle it's given us a cathedral it's given us the clamshells it's given us stalks with little dots on it's given us flowers it's given us circles there's lots of lovely things that can be done just by starting off with the cathedral window so I will go ahead now and finish some more off and show you a picture at the end. So do a double cathedral. That's where you come inside and make another layer. 